So I don't know. I don't know. Promises Abbott. attention. Chigging. Now, Geralt. I'm fine. Now go and give Avalok my heartfelt regards. Oh, please tell me that I get to play a Siri for the Avalok fight, please. Or at least both of them were like, it's like a double team and like I get to switch between them. Is that loot? Wow. That tells you how loot focused I am. That I just like, I saw something kind of glowy on the final boss fight, which by the way, we're going to quick save. Just stab him and just be done with it. Be like, game over. Cool. Thanks. <laughs> you and Siri live happily ever after with Yennefer. Geralt, so unfortunate. I'd hoped you wouldn't have to witness this. Where's Siri? Nearby. Listen. Shut up. I've heard enough of your bullshit. Draw your weapon. Let's get this over with. Okay. I'll just kill him. I'll just kill him. Spare you. I think you will not attack one unarmed. Wouldn't be so sure. I'm in a foul mood. <laughs> I am not your foe. I am merely helping Cirilla. I don't believe you. Can't. Not after all that's happened. Will you believe me? No. Avalok speaks the truth. I asked him to help me open the tower because I aim to enter it. I. Why the hell would you do this? The Wild Hunt's been defeated. The White Frost has not. The prophecies are true. I have seen worlds bound in ice. I know what awaits you. Only the Elder Blood can stop the White Frost. Only I can stop it. Glad there's no timer on this one. I don't care. Let's go. You don't have to make the sacrifice. There's no annihilation coming. Avalox, but nonsense in your head. I do believe the last one. Hmm. Avalox muddled your mind with a fortune teller's fables. You're wrong. The white frost truly does approach. Worlds will freeze, one after another, and all life will be eradicated. Avalark gave me a choice. I made the decision. I must stop it. There's got to be another way. What can you know about saving the world, silly? You're but a witcher. Hey, that was me. This is my story, not yours. You must let me finish telling it. Man, that line. Don't do this to me. Please, not now. Oh, Geralt, believe me. The tavern, mulled wine, our boots drying by the fire. I'd like nothing better. I can't. I must try. For you, Yen, Triss, for everyone. Keep your fingers crossed.
I don't know what happened. We're going to find out together. Two weeks later. The gentleman will follow. Okay. okay. Captain. Report. Fort Kaiskoda. The Funsberg division as a whole. Deserters. Does General Voorhis know? I'm, s I'm still kind of processing everything, so I apologize if I have no thoughts at the moment. But from what I can tell, a lot of the stuff that you do... Oh, I thought he was in the underwear. A lot of the stuff that you do is done, or all of the, the choices, like like all the flashbacks you saw there that you make with Siri, affect something. Whether or not she does it or not, I don't know. We're gonna we're gonna follow this guy though. Speak. Siri is dead. How did it happen? The white cold. They're familiar with the prophecy. Siri tried to stop it. She did, but paid the ultimate price. Where is the body? I doubt it'll ever be found. Who else knows? Avalach, Elven Sage. But I doubt you'll find him either. And Yennefer? She's decided to stay in the north. Provided you don't object. I don't. And you? Mm. Plenty of work for witchers after a war. I'll travel east, maybe north. Did Cyrilla say... Did she ask you to convey anything? Uh, sure. She regretted not getting a chance to say goodbye. Did she tell you this? Really? Didn't have to. She wanted to make peace. I know that. If there's nothing else... There is, but you may go. Witcher! I do not wish to see you ever again. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. I guess let's see the rest of the epilogue and what happens. Sometime later, on the road to Vizima. Need a hand with your wagon? Uh, no. It's not exactly ours. More a captured vehicle. Booty, you might say. Folk must have abandoned it in their rush. To where, I don't know. Be a shame for the Reds to claim it. Loot it. Change is coming. Grown accustomed, we have. With the Black Ones gone, witch hunters will move in. Yet life will roll on. We've to seize the day. True that. So, let's get to work before night creeps up on us. Hmm. Sure you don't need any help? I believe we will manage. Where are you headed? Nearest inn, by the looks of it. Yeah. 
Supposed to meet someone first, at the former campsite of the Nilf Guardians. You take care now. Okay. So, ooh, I leveled up. May as well take care of that real quick. Uh, green. Or, no, you know what? Let's just... Uh, let's just upgrade that. Okay. That's it, Roach. So... There's a couple, there's a few endings from what I can gather. And we, we, I don't think we quite have seen the end of the game yet because we still gotta, and we, we still have something and something begins. So we're just going to get to the, this fortress and kind of get our epilogue. But, um, yeah, once, once we're done with that, I guess I'll chat about the endings because again, gotta, <laughs> Got got an interesting story that happened there. How far is this thing? Seriously. Oh wait, am I back in the beginning area? No. That's not where I'm at, right? No. Okay, now I gotta double check. I don't think it is. Oh, interesting. It begins right I did that again. It ends where it started. Let's see what's up here. Beautiful lighting, though. Boom. Master Ort. <sighs> Probably got held back. You're late. Soldiers. Blocking the roads, I know. No matter. You have it? As agreed. 38 and a half inch blade. Weight just under 40 ounces. Silver plated siderite steel core. Glyphs and runes both the length of the blade and on the hilt. It's a gorgeous sword. Beautiful. Yeah. Been in this trade for three decades. Only the best swordsman of the coin for my wares. Yeah. When I say no witcher has, or ever had a better weapon. You ought to trust me. Reputation precedes you, Master Ort. I'd never doubt you. The inscription, as you asked. Uh... Yeah. Zirael. Swallow. Classic Elder Speech runes. No styling. Simple and precise. May I? It is yours. If you'd like to test it, had my lackeys put out a training dummy. Mm -hmm. Your payment. Gems only, as requested. If you've an eye out for work, heard a striggers prowl in the Maribor forest. Thanks. Need to visit the tavern first, but after, who knows? Good luck on the path, Witcher. This is fascinating, because, like, the game has this... Super somber in, or in super somber mood, um, because like Siri just like I mean they just like drop that bomb on you. They're like, yeah, Siri's dead. Master Witcher, over here. Plenty of blades to try if it's your will. Nah, dog. Thank you though. Come on. So, Rich. essentially, I am now going to that inn. Ah, yeah, let's. See, I didn't even know that this was going to be... No. Thank you. I didn't even know that this was going to be an option, but I could totally just run over here. Just quick travel. Yeah, super somber. Which I think they're treating it very well. I guess we'll... We'll see what our... What the heck? There's just a lot of people there. Spoopy. Witches, false healers, charm merchants, and filthy non humans. Man, this place has not gotten any better. But it's Redanian, so better than the, the black ones. Looks like a gift. 
No. Is it done? Yes. Did he believe you? I have no idea. <laughs> For the cockatrice. And we've a new contract. It won't pay much, but I think it worth the toil. You've been busy. It's yours. A sword. Swallow. Ooh, beautiful. May I? Not here. You'll have ample opportunity soon enough, Witcher. Yeah. Let's try it out then. Oh. Hell yeah. So we got the best ending. Radovid had many faults. He was cruel, impetuous, and pathologically ambitious. But he was a tactical genius. That's undeniable. Commanding forces far outnumbered by his foes, he handily defeated the invader from the south. The Redanian eagle spread its wings, taking all the north, including Novigrad and Nisra. With victory in the war against Nilgard secured, Radovid proceeded to complete his witch hunt. As they had in Novigrad, pyres burned into Meria and Edirne, lands now liberated by the Vidanian monarch. In the drive for moral renewal, simple herbalists, pellers, healers, and non-humans, all supposed heretics, were murdered in droves. For many, freedom beneath Radovid's scepter proved more tragic than servitude to another. As long as his armies went from one victory to the next, Emir's subjects remained boundlessly obedient. When a string of humiliating defeats proved Varembri's fallible, the opposition, thus far secret, attacked. The subjects of the Emperor who had danced on the graves of his foes laid him to rest in a tomb of his own. Correct. While the continent bled engulfed by war, Skellica bloomed under Ceres's enlightened rule. Yes. Unlike those who had come before her, the young queen did not raid foreign shores. Looking instead to her people, tending to her land, the island-bound nation prospered, though its fangs of yore were dulled. Cyrilla, Fiona, Ellen, Rhiannon, heir to Nilfgaard's throne, chose the life of a witcher on the path. Geralt taught her all he knew, every skill he possessed, then each set off on their own. Soon, word of the ashen-haired witcheress had spread throughout the north, from the Yoruga the mountains of Kovir. While monarchs moved borders and populations, Geralt and Yennefer lived a calm, quiet life, far from all things political. They breakfasted well after noon, more often than not in bed, and passed the days on lazy strolls and long conversations. Boring, you say? Perhaps. But both had sought this more than anything else. Nice. I'm happy with all that. Yeah, I'm going to say this just before I get into discussion here. These people well deserve more uh, credit than I do for any of this. I say this every time I get to the credits of a game. These people made the game. I just played it and provided stupid commentary over it. They deserve the credit here. So I, I would suggest watching all the way through the credits. Plus, it's gorgeous. Look at all this like hand-drawn stuff. Great. So, to the game, um, there's a lot to talk about there, but there are three endings. There's Siri dies, Siri becomes a witcher, and Siri becomes empress. And I think we got what I consider the best one, where she becomes a witcher. And I want to just straight up say, I never looked at any guides. I didn't want to be spoiled by the ending. Somehow I managed this entire time to not be spoiled by anything that happens in this game. 
despite having uh, several people around me who have finished it, they know better uh, than to tell me the ending. So I got that ending simply by doing exactly what I said from the beginning of the game. I was going to roleplay as Geralt, and I was going to make the choices that I believed he would make, that Geralt would make. And we got what I consider the best ending. I don't think that could have gone any better than it did. And I love that. Like, I can't I can't be any more happier than, than what just happened there with her becoming a witcher. Um, but all of that stems from choices you make with her and the choice to, like, either take her to her father or not and stuff like that. And whether you're comforting her or, or, or entertaining her her ideas and stuff as we did because we're just like series the best character in this game let's give her as much attention as we can and then it was like everything else fell into place there too the way i wanted it to you know with uh with everything in skellige actually just from start to finish i think we did really good there and yennefer and her being the uh, like the romantic interest and I feel like I feel like we played it all out perfectly and I I, I don't think I would really change any cho any choices we made from the beginning I think they were all great and I loved them all um yeah that was really good this game is fantastic it's definitely one of the best RPGs uh a significant improvement on the previous two games and we didn't touch most of the side quests we did a little bit of side quests at the beginning of the game but when I realized oh this is gonna take forever uh, we just pushed right through and I could have done more episodes at the end here instead of doing like two a week what I ended up doing um, and getting through the game a lot faster but I felt like I needed the time for the game to breathe and for us to get through it and we did and there's still two expansions there's blood and wine and the heart of stone and everything I've heard from those are they're fantastic we're just I feel like I don't want to drag that on it. Like this was such the perfect ending that I don't want to touch anything else. I'm just like, this is beautiful. I'm wrapping it up here. Um, so we're not going to do the expansions, but that said, I mean, that was, that was quite a ride. It was still less episodes than our longest series, which is Dragon Age Inquisition. Um, but I, I did enjoy it. I enjoyed it quite a bit. So yeah, if you want to see all of the other choices in the game, or the expansionary content, then by all means pick up the game because it keeps going really cheap during these winter sales and stuff. And uh, it's, 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 yeah, well worth it. And again, I just can't, I, like, I'm so ecstatic with our ending. I feel like we nailed it and I did it accidentally um, just, just by following the rule that I set out to the begin with, which is that I'm going to play Geralt like I believe Geralt would be played. And we nailed it. I think we, we absolutely nailed it. It's just ecstatic about that. And it's just I know I keep saying it, but I'm really, really happy with that. So now that this series is done, uh, we have room on our channel to do other things. There's still some other things we need to finish up um, as we're pushing through Dishonored 2 at the moment for the finishing this. But, you know, I, I feel like there's a little bit of room for, you know, a new series, maybe something Star Wars-y. We'll see how that ends up uh, popping in. I'm going to let the credits play through as they are deserved of. Pick up the game, enjoy it, and uh, may you get a good ending too. Man, it was a long run. I'm not going to lie. 100 and something odd episodes, almost 130. Thank you everybody that came and watched them. Thank you for devoting the time to that. Thank you for you know, supporting it, especially if you watched from start to finish when the episodes came out. But if you went back and cleaned up the episodes and uh, watched them and binge watched them, which I know a lot of people do, then thank you for that as well. I hope you enjoyed. And with that, we shall see you guys next time.